this is our this adventure. is our adventures headed to Crab Island. On this video, we're gonna give you the ins and outs of Crab Island and what we do to enjoy it. If you rent through Luther's, make sure you do your online. They have a online waiver form that you could do ahead of time. I wasn't thinking, I, we had done that last time and I so forgot, so we had to sit here and do it on our phone. It was horrible doing it here, but it would be easier to do it online. Here at Crab Island, there's vendors that come around and sell them ice cream. There's food, boats that are hanging out out here. When we got here, there was nobody here, and now it is packed. This is like the coolest place to spend the day, and there's so many ways to get out here. You can rent a pontoon boat, you can do a tiki bar. They'll bring you out here. You can even do a Crab Island excursion and they'll bring you out here. You can rent jet skis, come out here, paddle boards. So there's so many ways and so many different budget levels that you can come out here and enjoy Crab Island too. Our hotel 
gosh, that looks so tiny. Way out there. Belly flop, belly flop. Do a belly flop. <laughs> belly flop, yeah. <laughs> you got it. Just want your glasses back, Papa. Water here is so pretty and clear, and I mean, like you can walk for miles and miles. Well, probably not miles and miles, but it's a long way. As far as you can see, the light blue water that you can walk, and everybody is just walking around and having a really good time out here. Crab Island is located on the north side of the Destin Bridge, also known as the Merriller Bridge, at the southern entrance of the Chowachi Bay inside Destin's East Pass. It is only a five-minute ride from the Destin Harbor. Crab Island is only accessible by boat or other watercraft. Due to the distance from the shore and the strong tidal currents, boat traffic that surrounds it. You can rent or bring your own boat or do an excursion and let someone else take you there. You can also kayak or paddleboard if you're up for an adventure and a good workout. You can tour the sandbar by jet ski. Just keep in mind that the rentals do not have anchors so you won't be able to stop at Crab Island and get off the jet ski and walk around. The most popular, if you're comfortable driving your own boat, is to rent a pontoon. You can get them for four to eight hours, many prices and sizes. Most can have 12 passengers. Prices start around 400 and go up. There's also Tiki Bars that have three-hour Crab Island Sandbar Cruises. This way, there are only six people on each Tiki, so it's less crowded than the shuttles. You can get there by shuttle to Crab Island. Also, the prices vary and there's several to choose from. We did notice most of them had anywhere from 15 to 30 people on each boat. There are a variety of vendors at the sandbar from March through October, selling everything from barbecue sandwiches to ice cream and t-shirts. Vendors are independently owned and operate businesses, so there can be different vendors at the sandbar on any given day. There's many things that you can do while at Crab Island, relaxing on your boat while soaking up the sun, paddling around the sandbar on a kayak or paddle board, joining in a game of water volleyball, Enjoying a cold beverage, alcohol is allowed, but BYOB as alcohol can no longer be sold on the water. Snorkeling around your boat, watching the dolphins and the other marine life, tossing a football and frisbee and diving into the water to catch it, making new friends and people watching. There's a lot of things you can bring, and I will put a list on the screen, but the main things I believe you need to bring is a cooler with ice, a float, 
and I would do some way to tie it off to the boat since the current will take you away. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video about Crab Island and the ins and outs and the things that we have learned by coming out here in a few years. If you've never been to Crab Island, you have to come try it here. It is so cool. You will enjoy it so much. It's such a different experience than being on the beach and you're out here having a blast with all these people. Well, if you're not subscribed already, please subscribe and hit that bell notification so you're notified the next time we upload a video. Also, if you enjoyed this video and it helped you out, give us a thumbs up and like that video. Till next time, like and subscribe.